A presentation was given tonight to discuss the future of the Youngstown Air Reserve Station and Vianna Township. Right now, YARS is waiting to hear if they'll be the home to eight new C-130J aircrafts. But the Department of the but the Department of Defense wants to make sure no problems will come up in the future. First News reporter Jacob Thompson has that story for us, new at 10. During a special meeting, Jolie Green with the Trumbull County Planning Commission presented their findings of the joint land use study with the Youngstown Air Reserve Station. This plan was put together to help prevent any issues in the future if the base gets new C-130J aircrafts. For um, this piece of land, here is the recommended uh, building height maximum. The purpose is to prevent any tall structures that could affect any of the aircrafts. The maximum buildable height, even directly adjacent to the runway on, in certain locations, is over 100 feet tall. The Department of Defense also requires outdoor lighting in specific area. As of now, Vianna Township has everything in place, but the study is for the future. Okay, you're good today. What kind of rules and regulations, zoning expectations do you have in place to make sure nothing stupid happens down the road? One area that is already affected is Matthews High School. This viewer video shows the planes loudly flying just above the school. School board president Beth Haddle says teachers have to stop their lessons because of the noise. The recommendation is to relocate the school, but the issue becomes funding. We won't get a lot from Ohio facilities commission because of our evaluation. It's right. only 16%. So, you know, we need just some clear-cut directives as to where to go and how to approach uh, these folks in order to get, get noticed and get help. Ohio House Representative Nick Santucci says they can help the school as much as they can, but it's more at the federal level. Green says she's been in talk with Congressman Dave Joyce and Senator J.D. Vance's people about this. I understand that's the difficulty in trying to secure funds, and uh, we will we'll be willing partners and have been just don't have any answers for you right now. As of now, everything is just a recommendation. In Vienna, Jacob Thompson, WKBN 27 First News.